goodbye. I'm gonna see my father standing at the door. You're gonna smile and say a
tired. Amen. Can't go to sleep, Derek. We'll do a, we had a couple of requests. I think somebody wanted a brother here on front with Mike to sing. Bless his heart. We're going to do that, and we will do the other one for you. Try that one. And, uh, let's do Hello Mama first. And, uh, I, this, this may be the one you're talking about, so uh, uh, I hope it is. Hello, Mama. I just called to tell you all those tears you shed for me, they were not in vain. Something happened tonight while driving down that country road. I thought that you should be the first to know. And all those dreary days are over now. Your sleepless nights are past. And all those prayers that you have raised so long, their answer now and last. For I thought. to be the mama you can sleep tonight for I found Jesus now everything's alright Amen How can my men can remember the night they found Jesus? Amen Where he I found him He wasn't lost I was the one who was lost Amen Amen you know, I've remembered. Every night before I go to sleep, she'd ask the Lord my soul to keep that I might find a way. You know, I'm so thankful for all those loneliness and wasted those prayers keep ringing in my ear Every night and day And all those dreary days are over now Your sleepless nights are past And all those prayers
First of all, I'm not saying it's good to be here, amen? Amen. Pray God, I'd rather be here than I had any hospital. I'd rather be here than I had to fight in jail. Praise God, I'd rather be here just about anywhere I know of right now, amen? Yeah. I'm because I know when I'm in the house of God, God's in the house also, amen? Praise God, and I love to be in the presence of God. I love to be in the presence of godly people. And most of all, I love to be in the presence of the Holy God. And the Holy One, amen. Now the Spirit is real, the Spirit is alive. And praise God, I just thank God for everything here tonight. Praise God. You know, the Bible tells me, praise God, that we are to give God praise in all things. Amen. Not for all things, but in all things. And, uh, you know, through everything that just happened down here a while ago, uh, praise God, that just shows you one more time, praise God, how what an awesome God that we serve. Amen. You know, I think a lot of times, praise God, that, you know, we'd be a whole lot better off. And, uh, you know, it just seems like the world is, is, is all turning their back on our God. And, and it seems like if, if we start telling the world how big our God is instead of the God, how big our problem is, praise God. Uh, my problem ain't nothing compared to my God, amen. I uh, praise God, all I gotta do is lift my hand. I uh, praise God, it's God, uh, amen. Uh, the Holy Ghost is up, up in here tonight, amen. I uh, praise God, I love it uh, when the Spirit of God uh, gets to moving, amen. You know, I've been many places, I've been many churches, and praise God, I've been I, 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 just about all over the world doing what we do. And you know, there's a lot of churches, praise God, that will welcome God, and there's a lot of places that won't. I'll never forget one time when I first started preaching, I, was, I, I was, seemed like I was led to this church and to preach a revival, and man, when I walked out of there, Lord, I preached a revival for a week. I think I had one woman smile at me during the whole service. I ain't lying. Last night I almost brought my shovel, praise God. I thought I was going to have to bury everybody in there, amen. Like preaching in the funeral home. But uh, nevertheless, praise God, when I walked out of the door, I asked God, I said, God, why did you do this to me, man? I said, you know, uh, I'm, I'm just kind of new at this. And, and God just looked at me and just spoke to me in, a, in, in that old soft voice. He said, well, I've been trying to get in that church for 30 years. I just going to see if they'll welcome you. They wouldn't welcome me, amen. And praise God, you know, when you go in uh, preaching the word of God, ain't too many churches going to accept you, amen. I uh, praise God what the Bible said in the last days. Uh, all of these things is coming about. Uh, what did it say, brother? He said they're going to start calling good bad and bad good, amen. I uh, praise God that's what's going on uh, now today, amen. Uh, you don't have preachers preaching uh, just about anymore on homosexuality, on gays and lesbians and uh, living together, amen, adulteries and, and all of this stuff. You don't have preachers preaching against it anymore. Everybody said, well, you don't need to be preaching about that. You'll lose your congregation. Praise God again, a child of God. Uh, you don't need to be in the congregation. Uh, anyway, praise God. If you're just here to see and be seen, you don't saw, you don't see him. Now it's time to do something different. Amen. You know, God is real. God is alive. Too many times we want to play church. Praise God, church is, is nothing to play with. Amen. Old boy work the other day was asking me, he said, brother, he said, he said, I know you go to church and I know you do this and I know you do that and, 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 and all of this stuff. And I told him, I said, you know one thing. I said, I'd rather do everything I do and when it's all said and done, find out there's not a God than to do nothing for my entire life and found out that there really was a God. Amen. Amen. Boy, I'm going to tell you, man, when we get the world out of church and get the church out of the world, then you're going to start seeing a difference. Amen. Amen. Well, praise God, as long as you mix it too, it ain't going to mix. 
because the world don't understand us and we don't understand the world. Amen. Now the Bible said, praise God, when you were saved and sanctified, you were set apart. Amen. Uh, you don't go back and do the same old things you used to do. Uh, you don't run with the same old crowd uh, you used to run with. Amen. Uh, you don't do the things. Amen. Uh, God saved you from sin. Uh, he didn't save you uh, to sin. Amen. Uh, we can do that pretty good on our own. Amen. But praise God, I tell you, when he got a hold of me, he got a hold of the good and amen. I ain't been perfect, but praise God, I love serving my God. Amen. If y'all know this song, stand up and sing it with us, amen. If you don't stand up and sing it anyway, amen, you're going to realize we don't know it either. I'll tell you about the drummer now. Have you ever had a bad day? Ever had a sad day? Nothing but going to try. Give it all the need to lay it down and leave the turning if I'm not your child. Just stand up, give me love, be just stand up, be a bit of a stand up. Tell the town about you stand up, can't touch your mind. If you ever had a certain trouble, then you're alone, you don't come back. Thought you couldn't make it, did you let it take it? See when you found a hole, but you did. So stand up. Leave me love, Jesus, tender, give me the fire, tender, tell us all about his tender, give me the fire. His last verse is a good one, right? Well, I thought I was a good man, thought I did it all, man, thought I knew what to do. Give all the fathers a big hand in here tonight. Amen. I praise God because so many of y'all will see you tomorrow. And, uh, but nevertheless, y'all remember us when you pray. And we'll always be remembering y'all. Amen. 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 They'll be back here in September 6th for our homecoming. Amen. 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 September when? Saturday night, uh, over the church where I'm at in Rolland, Alabama, we have an outdoor singing. 
Last year we had probably 200, 250 people there. And it's all outdoors. We set up the same play, uh, all outdoors. We call it the concert on the start. And we just have a good time. Uh, this time we're going to have uh, some different groups to be uh, us. And, and we're trying to get like probably five groups, four or five groups together. Uh, we usually to start about five o'clock. And we run all the way through to uh, everybody is through singing, so ain't no telling what time we'll get off. So if you go, don't leave your beans on the cook because you're liable to get them burnt. <laughs> we don't believe in taking no time for nothing. The only reason I like to be on time is to start service. Amen. Amen. The one Amen. time we finish, that's all in God's time. Amen. Amen. So we there until the Spirit gets through, but I want to say it's uh, uh, September the 29th. And I'll be sending some flowers up here to Brother Derek as soon as we get all the group lined up. And if y'all can, y'all please come be with us. If you can, at least be praying for us. Amen. 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 Thank you once again for having us, Brother Derek, Brother George. Appreciate you, buddy. George keeps me updated and texts me every once in a while and see how I'm doing and time we need in and I see him on Facebook all the time so uh, he's on there all the time that's Carol I guess he ain't got nothing else to do be on Facebook <laughs> but I'm glad he's here to do that amen at one time we sung up here and I didn't think he'd live next week or two he looked like death warmed over and I told him back here earlier I asked how he feel and he said he feel a lot better amen God is in the healing business amen amen He's still in control, amen. Well, we'll leave you with this song here tonight, amen. God bless you. We do have some products and stuff out there if anybody wants any of that stuff and that just puts a little gas to go somewhere else, amen. Now when I see the sunrise in the morning